Hey guys, it's Zeku. Today we're going to be playing Food Aiki 4. The Food Aiki game series is basically a travel simulator. If you've ever seen those videos that are about getting in the atmosphere of things like backwood camping, long train journeys, uh, solo abandoned urban exploration, sleeping on overnight ferries, Food Aiki is like a sampler platter of all of those things with some anime waifus thrown in for good measure. One unfortunate thing though is that this series was never really released outside of Japan, at least as of this recording. So I've played a bit of Furaiki 3 on the Vita, but for Furaiki 4, this is more or less a first experience playthrough. And my Japanese isn't bad, but my kanji knowledge is a little bit lacking. And over the course of this playthrough, I'll try to convey the gist of what's happening, uh, the things the character is encountering, and the people we meet. All right, enjoy. All right, we'll just start from the beginning. This is Food IQ4. Wow, that looks super nice. Hey, time to take a break. You'll rest up. that crisp bike picture oh, I can already I can already start taking pictures nice so I take off my helmet release all of hot air from inside take a deep breath Breeze, breeze feels good. So starting to relax. I'm gonna walk around, look for some lunch. You gotta remember to take your camera. So, Minamo spreads out for me. Feel the wind on your face, see the waves. It's definitely pretty big. Okay, so I can't look around yet. It's not a free free looking part. Oh, now now I can? Oh. Oh, let's focus. There we go. Not bad. You're pretty good. So I do not know the names of any of these mountains. But I feel I feel all right knowing that Japanese streamers also have not memorized a lot of these names. That's nice. Got a little shaded walkway over to the taxi stand. So, time to look for some lunch. Oh, okay. Wait, that stamina is my stamina. Not the car's fuel tank, but it does have a full to empty. And a Starbucks down there. And a food court.
a Yamaha FZR. I know nothing about motorcycles. I'm sorry. <laughs> So, happen to see. Oh. Oh. There's a little bit of, uh, of pixelation, but it's not bad. I guess you have to, um, yeah, there's a covered walkway we were looking at earlier. Like, I guess from a camera perspective, I guess you have to take uh, the good with the bad. Like, you're getting a 360 view. And a pretty wild, like, depth of field, right? It's kind of an old model. It's seen some use, huh? That was a pretty helmet, though. Oh, look at that. Looks like it's bone stock, huh? Decent, decent mileage. I guess not that high. <laughs> yeah, you know, probably a stranger just like looking all over at your bike would make you a little annoyed. It's like, oh, sorry, um... I might have to turn up the voice and turn the music down. Right? Uh... I'll turn all these up a little bit, I guess. Right? If I remember correctly, the main character's older sister is also into um, bikes. Well, I mean, that's a it's a nice sentiment to be like, ah, if you like bikes, you can't be all bad. I guess her father got her into it. We're trying to... It's not a pickup line, I swear. That's 
いきなり好きですよとか言っちゃうし No, we're moving, we're moving quick. Oh, okay, now I can, I can set my name. Yeah, I'm, I'm a blogger. Here you go. Alright, our character is 26. Oh, she's 27. The Onesan. Onesan power. Okay, so I guess usually she's uh she's an op an office worker in Tokyo, but she got tired of going around the same areas in Kanto, so uh both her or she's here in Gifu to uh I guess get a change of scenery, and our main character's here on assignment uh from his magazine slash uh site that he works for to I guess document his journey. It's like, oh, so what are you writing about? Oh, sorry. Maybe I shouldn't ask because of trade secrets. Yeah, so then there's this uh, competition. So all of the... Uploading it to the uh, the website of the news site or I don't know magazine site, whatever you want to call it. Yeah.絶対見に行くね。でさ、どんなことを書くの？岐阜だからやっぱ戦国時代中心の歴史ものとか白川郷みたいな観光的なものとか。yeah, so she's asking, hey, are you going to write about, um, what are you going to write about Gifu? Is it about the Sengoku period history stuff? Or just like, you know, touristy type stuff? Uh, and so we answer, hey, it's not like uh, there's like a set uh, topic. We're just kind of take a journey and write whatever strikes our fancy. Yeah, so it's not a trip, it's a journey. So now she's mulling it over about the difference between taking a trip with an itinerary and sort of wandering on your own. She's like, hey, you're trying to pick me up after all. Heh <laughs> oh. oh. 
Get a picture for the magazine. Oh. 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 You know, maybe I'll turn it to autofocus. Cause <laughs> I don't... This, is, this is okay, right? It's fine. Oh, wait, no. Now I'm supposed to take it. There we go. Are her eyes different colors? I think they are, right? So I was saying that she made it sound like she's not an experienced rider, but she clearly has knows how to handle her bike. I'm not Yuhara. She wants us to be more familiar with her color. What? Kiyone. <laughs> She leaves the surf's area. And our stomach is rumbling. Oh yeah, so Hikari. She's our she's our senpai, right? She calls Chihiro Chi Chi Kun. Come on, come on now. He's uh, complaining that she treats him like a kid. Be like, you know, you're really going to ask a man in his late 20s, like, oh, your tummy hurt? <laughs> like he's a kid? <laughs> Answer is, we're just hungry. We're just hungry. <laughs> Oh, yep. Yeah, so, okay. Yep. Um, wait, no, this way is a dead end. Oh. Oh, yep, I went the wrong way. I sure did. I gotta pay attention where the... the connection... Okay, let's go that way then. Let's go. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, oh, this way? Yeah, there we go.
私も君の記事楽しみにしてるからねルポライターさんあらぜはあいいわ言うまでもなくルポには写真も大事よこまめに撮るようにねこれは先輩写真家からのアドバイスよ She's just reminding us to take lots of photos for the article. So we gotta take lots of pictures, but not waste all the space on our SD card or something. Let's see what we got. Ah, Zarusova. Zarusova is the specialty here, I guess. Oh, we got fresh, fresh local wasabi. Yeah, real wasabi tastes totally different than the uh, the ground like horseradish stuff you get at a lot of sushi places. Oh, and we got soft serve. Everybody, is there anybody who doesn't love soft serve? Let's just go explore the rest of this place. See what's on the other side of here. I got some more view. Oh, let's get going. Let's get on the road. Oh, somebody's calling. So, oh, wow. Good to know. Hmm. Okay. So I guess there's a built-in glossary I can use. Shut up for this this intro.
Food IQ4. Let's go. Nice. So that was the cold open. Uh, I might have to call it there. But we'll be back next time to pick up right here. All right. See you in the next part.